All right, so it's daytime because I was working till like four o'clock in the morning. Got the screw in there. Yeah. All right. Got the front suspension off. Started uh, doing a little more cutting. I've got to cut all that out right here and make that all smooth. Put my bag bracket in there. Had to cut some more out of the those. I'm going to take them up to work and use my little belt sander to grind this out smooth. But, we'll get there. Nice right hand drive steering box. Oh yeah, bolts on. And it's a non-power steering because this truck came with non-power steering. So I asked if I could find one and luckily someone did. So. I actually have a factory right-hand drive non-power steering steering box so got a two-piece drive shaft because that came with the uh, this frame so this frame was off of another truck that um, I'm having to I'm using it to rebuild because the frame that was underneath the Mazda out there was in a uh, really bad shape uh, built it when I was younger uh, drug a lot um, everywhere I went I laid it out and would drag it and ended up dragging an inch um, down through the frame and so it had holes in the frame so yeah I had to start with the new rails so the old rails I just cut off and took to the junkyard but I've got a bunch of parts sitting in here and my factory dash that's going to be really cool whenever I finally get this together. Got uh, the dimple die holes in the fenders and so yeah got Bravo front end and then on this side this was Airbag Joe's fender off of his daily that he had. So I thought it's cool that I got to keep a part of his daily. And then this is the bed from the parts truck. I gotta straighten it a little bit. Got a couple dents in it, but ain't nothing that I can't handle. And then the motor is uh, bad shape because it's been sitting like this for at least two years so it's going to go to a machine shop see what they can do about it and go from there and rebuild the transmission probably as well we'll cross that bridge when we get to it and i thought this door was in a little better shape than the other door so i decided to use it from the parts truck so I hope you enjoyed, um, give this video a like and uh, I'll post more later, thanks.